Hello there world! My name is Tara Taylor and in two weeks time I will be a graduate from Michigan State University, Go Green. Uh, with the end of my college career coming, I've really been thinking about what I want to do with my life and my future and the answer for the past five years has always been the same. I want to work for Ellen. So today, April 17th, 2013, I'm officially kicking off my YouTube campaign for I Want to Work for Ellen. And I even have this awesome shirt made. Check it out. Oh, what's that? It's just Ellen's face. It's just Ellen's face, everybody. Ooh, 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 ooh. So, that's pretty exciting. Um, each week, I'm going to post a video and send it off to my hero, Miss Ellen, and there's it's, the topics are going to vary. Um, I don't want to keep you keep doing the same thing because that's good. That gets boring, obviously. Um, and I'm also creating a Facebook page where there'll be some other uh, fun things going on there, like um, myself and some photos that um, Ellen didn't know I was there, but I was. And so uh, I'm gonna put those online and also the adventures of Flat Ellen. We, uh, we've already had some fun together. We've gone on a couple adventures, and um, I'm excited to share those. Uh, Ellen and I crack each other up all the time. We make a great team. She, um, she's a little more quiet than real-life Ellen, which is okay. Um, she's just a little shy. You know, that's all right. Uh, this week, I just want to say hello and get acquainted so virtual handshake hello hello miss ellen and um i'm gonna hit the uh top five things we have in common not including the fact that we both find you funny um i think that's just a given so we'll move on uh number five we're gonna start at the bottom work our way up number five would be we both love justin timberlake the difference being I'm in love with him, and you love him like a son or um, a best friend or something of the sort. It's, you know, a little difficult because he's happily married, and I am completely and absolutely happy for them. Uh, I think it's wonderful when people find love, but when you love somebody since you were six, it's a little hard to let go and say goodbye. Um, number four would be we both love our moms. Your mom is very supportive. She's always at the show. Uh, she, you know, supports you in your career. My mom houses me and and pays for my groceries. Uh, so she sp probably supports me a little bit more uh, with finance. And, you know, but we both love our moms. So there we go. Number three for top things that we have in common is we both love animals. Uh, I have four dogs, two cats, and a rabbit. We like to call our house the house of love. Uh, my mom loves animals so much that she follows the Gentle Barn on Facebook, and she saw that they posted a um, a bulldog mix, a very beautiful dog, and she wanted me to get in the car, drive across country, and bring the dog back to our home. And then she realized that you had to be a resident of LA to get the dog and apparently that's the only flaw she saw in that plan obviously uh, number two is we both love to make people smile um, I think I'm funny which probably makes me not very funny but I try to make at least one person smile a day besides myself and I'm fortunate enough that that normally occurs so Good job, me. Pat on the back. Uh, that leads me to number one, the big one, scaring. Scaring brings so much joy to everyone, except for the person you're scaring, I've learned. Although, a big difference between our scaring is your scaries tend to react well. They think it's funny and, you know, they laugh it off and they're like, oh, you got me. My scaries get very angry. And I've gotten several death threats. So I don't know if I'm just scaring a little too aggressively or, or what. I'm going to try to work on that. Maybe it's because your scaries are on national television. I'm not really sure. But um, 
I've had to watch my safety a couple times. Almost lost a couple limbs. So that are the those are the top five things that we have in common. And I want to uh, to leave you with one of my favorite scares that I've done and caught on film. It's me scaring my little sister. Sorry. Uh, and I just want to say, to quote you, be kind to one another. And I will see you next week, Ellen.